When the east wind blows, the world holds its breath. The centerpiece of the parade, the DF-17, its distinctive wedge-shaped warhead represents a new era of hypersonic weaponry. From the ceremonial square to the harsh reality of the Gobi, the rocket force prepares for the unthinkable. The dawn of a new era in electronic warfare. Autonomous swarms provide an impenetrable electronic shield for the strategic convoy. The massive structure achieves vertical erection. With the explosive bolts fired, the warhead is revealed. Target coordinates uploaded. The quantum link is active. With the turn of a key, the decision is irreversible. The launch sequence is now armed. The iron rain begins. A weapon that cannot be blocked, only feared. At the edge of space, the ballistic arc ends. The glider begins its dance. This maneuver, the atmospheric skip, confuses enemy radars expecting a ballistic arc. Flying at Mach 10, the air itself turns into plasma, enveloping the weapon in a cloak of fire. The plasma sheath has caused a total communications blackout. The missile is now autonomous, flying purely on internal guidance. Surfing its own shockwave, it glides across continents, untouched by gravity's curve. Enemy sensors, blinded by the plasma and confused by the path, cannot predict the impact. The special ablative composite material is slowly charring and peeling away, layer by layer, carrying the heat away. Twenty strong, they streak across the sky, coordinated for a simultaneous strike. Time on target! The glide ends. Gravity reclaims the weapon for the final strike. In the world's most advanced wind tunnel, the physics of the future are forged in detonation. Billions of calculations per second model the chaotic violence of Mach 10 flight. This carbon-carbon composite is the only material known that survives 3,000 degrees Celsius. We are weaving the skin of the future. A single micron of deviation allows the plasma to tear the weapon apart. Once installed, the inertial guidance core provides absolute positioning, impervious to electronic warfare. With meticulous care, the payload is secured. The hypersonic glide vehicle is now fully armed and ready. The glider and the rocket unite. Speed meets range. Hidden within the arteries of civilian infrastructure, the strategic force is constantly moving, impossible to pin down. The shell game begins. These decoys must mimic the heat signature of a live launch. Go, move it. 30 seconds, heater's in place now. Advanced metamaterials bend light and radar, rendering the giants invisible to the orbital gaze. The Misha satellite network utilizes quantum entanglement to secure data transmission. Once synchronized, Hardened electronics ensure the Counter-Strike survives even the electromagnetic pulse of a nuclear detonation. Midnight refueling. 
a critical step in maintaining the relentless tempo of secret operations deep within the forest. As the sun rises, the chariots of fire are positioned, silent sentinels of the new day. Gone are the manual surveyors. Lasers align the chariot with the stars in milliseconds. This advanced AESA radar scans the skies, ensuring complete situational awareness. The digital eye never blinks. A digital glass cockpit puts the power of a strategic arsenal at the fingertips of a single commander. Biometric scan initiated. Analyzing tactical interface and retinal structure. Identity confirmed. The flight path is not an arc, but a predator's erratic hunt, impossible to predict. The final barrier is lifted. The will of the nation is concentrated into a single switch. Power, okay. Guidance, okay. Payload, okay. Ready to fire. The irreversible act. With the press of a single button, the signal is sent. There is no turning back. In that moment, the soldier understood the true meaning of overwhelming force. Orbital sensors scream the warning, but physics dictates it is already too late. It dances between the layers of the atmosphere, a phantom that cannot be caught. Intercept, intercept failed. Hugging the edge of the atmosphere, it remains hidden behind the curvature of the Earth until the final moment. Phase initiated. Seeker is online. Target designated. We have final lock on. Kinetic energy alone delivers a blow that breaks the keel of Titans. Battle damage assessment confirmed. The target is destroyed. Probability, 100%. All data transmitted to high command. A breakthrough achieved not by chance, but by the relentless pursuit of scientific truth. The strategic frontier expands, turning the near seas into a fortress of peace. The ultimate victory is the war that is never fought deterred by the mere presence of the sword. In modern warfare, the ability to reload and fire again is as vical as the weapon itself. Alignment! Secure the pins! At Mach 10, a single microcrack means catastrophic failure. The sonic probe ensures the integrity of the ablative defense system. 5,000 kilometers of reinforced tunnels form a subterranean fortress, impervious to orbital strike. Advanced solid-state chemistry ensures the dragon is ready to wake at a moment's notice, even after a decade of sleep. Quantum 
quantum link is established. The fire duck keys are now transmitting. Encrypted. Unbreakable. Behind the front line stands the reserve. A seemingly endless arsenal, waiting for the call. At the heart of the weapon lies a brain forged to survive the radioactive fire of a nuclear battlefield. Here, a powerful laser melts titanium powder layer by layer, forging parts impossible to cast traditionally. This is the future of metallurgy. Advanced coatings drink radar waves, allowing the Leviathan to fade into the background noise. These solid state battery banks allow the launcher to operate silently for days, essential for successful ambush tactics. Resembling a complex biological structure, this loom channels the digital commands that guide the missile to its target. Microseconds of controlled violence at the edge of space sever the booster from the blade. The central tire inflation system engages, autonomously lowering the pressure. This adaptation is crucial for maintaining mobility across unstable ground. A mirror polished to atomic perfection holds the key to striking a target halfway across the world. With this stamp, the missile is deemed qualified. It is transferred from the factory floor to the rocket force, ready for deployment. Unblinking eyes the size of mountains watch the horizon, ensuring no threat goes unseen. Deep within the Earth, the central nervous system processes the pulse of the battlefield. A WZ-8 hypersonic drone streaks through the stratosphere at Mach 5. It is the scout finding the curve. Artificial intelligence closes the kill chain in milliseconds, leaving the enemy nowhere to hide. As the balloon ascends, it gathers critical data on wind shear, data essential for the guidance of the billion-dollar missile now awaiting launch. This is the front line of the invisible war. The launch network must hold against all threats. The Gobi Desert. It's not just the missile trucks. We see the massive logistical tail, command vehicles, radar trucks, and fuel tankers. The ultimate authority rests in the hands of the few, carrying the weight of history. A glowing dome of radar coverage creates an impenetrable roof. This strategic umbrella ensures the safety of the DF-17 launch. The scars of the atmosphere are the medals of a successful return from the edge of oblivion. From the desert sands to the open ocean, the dragon's reach knows no boundaries. A shield forged by the people, more the people, standing guard over the nation's dream. For the modernization of the People's Liberation Army, we swear to not obey the commands of the Khalid of China. True power is not the ability to destroy, but the capacity to prevent destruction. As the sun sets on the old world, the guardians of the new remain vigilant. Their watch is eternal. The east wind blows strong, carrying the destiny of a rising civilization.